What's up guys, Christian here and welcome to another video. We are gonna unlock this phone to use it with any SIM card in any country. It's gonna be very simple. We're gonna do everything together step by step. And after we unlock this phone, we will be able to use it with any carrier. Uh, now, there are a couple of things that I have to mention before we start. Uh, the first thing is that this is a carrier unlock. This is not a passcode or security unlock. This simply means unlocking the network of your Samsung in order to use your phone with other networks like AT&T, T-Mobile, um, Vodafone, Orange, any other SIM card. Uh, the other thing that I have to mention is that this is a 100% legal, legit way to unlock any smartphone. Um, so yeah, just keep that in mind. And the other thing, the last thing is that uh, nothing uh, will happen in terms of uh, damages to this phone. This is not a hacking. This is nothing uh, more than a simple uh, way to unlock the network, okay? So it's not nothing related to hacking or illegal stuff. It is a 100% legit way. Uh, with that said, we're gonna start. So the first thing you have to do is to get your phone's IMEI number. Uh, sometimes you have it in the back part of your phone here, written down on the back part. Um, but you can also dial star hash zero six hash. And you will see that your IMEI number will show up in the screen of your phone. We're gonna use only the first 15 digits. So keep this number in hand because we're gonna need it in a few seconds. So if you can see right here, we're gonna use only the first 15 digits. All right, the next step will take place on the computer. So I'm just gonna put my phone away, but keep the number, uh, this number close. All right. All right, so the next step is to go to the internet. Here we will unlock the phone. We have to fill in the form, the brand of your phone, then you're gonna write down your IMEI number. That's the number we got at the beginning of the video. So just make sure you write it down correctly. Then you have to type the email where you want to receive your code or the notification that your phone has been unlocked. So just make sure you write it down correctly. It's very important. Otherwise you won't get your unlock code. So just make sure it is 100% correct. All right, so now you have to wait until you get your unlock code. This will take a couple of days, as I said before. So you have to be very patient. But for this example, I'm gonna show you how the email I got uh, looks. And as you can see here, I got this message and it confirms that the phone has been unlocked. So I'm just gonna open it. So as you can see here, it says that everything went successful and now we have instructions on how to activate the unlock. In some cases, you're gonna have an unlock code. In other cases, you simply will get a confirmation that your phone has been remotely unlocked. Either way, I'm gonna show you how to do the unlock or how to activate the unlock. I'm gonna switch back cameras. So after receiving that email, you will have two options to unlock your phone and it depends on your carrier. For example, for some carriers, you're gonna have an application, it's called Unlock App, and you will have it somewhere here. Uh, you have to look for that application and click Unlock Device, and your unlock should be activated with that. But if you don't have that application right here, I'm gonna show you the other method, which is the most common method there is to unlock or to insert the unlock code. So the first thing we have to do is to turn off the phone. So we're gonna slide down, and we're gonna hit where it says Turn Off, and we're gonna completely power off the device. Once your phone is completely off, we're gonna insert a SIM card from a different carrier. And then we're gonna power on the phone again. All right, so as you can see, this message is requesting a SIM network unlock pin, and we have one out of 10 attempts to insert the correct unlock code. So we're gonna go ahead and insert correctly the, the code we got in the email. It's just gonna take a few seconds. So make sure you write it on correctly, and then we're gonna hit unlock, and we should get a success message. SIM network unlock successful, perfect. That means that the phone was unlocked successfully, and now we're able to use this phone with any carrier. As you can see here, I have a full signal bar, and my phone is now currently running on T-Mobile, and was originally unlocked to AT&T. If you get an incorrect unlock code, no worries, you can email them back, and they'll send you a correct code based on your IMEI number. And it is as simple as that, guys. That's how you unlock this phone, any Samsung Galaxy out there. And now this phone is compatible with any SIM card in any country. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. Don't forget to click like, subscribe. And if you have any questions, just leave them down on the comment section down below.